the South Thompson Street Church of Christ. Amen. Uh, it's been there, I believe, two, three months now. Since July. Since July. <laughs> <laughs> Since all right, July. all right. So he'll be the next voice that you hear again of Brother Lorenzo Hannah. If you have your Bible with you this uh, afternoon, we invite your attention to the first. Peter, chapter 1, verses 15 and 16. That first Peter, chapter 1, verses 15 and 16. And the Bible reads, But as he which had called you is holy, so be ye holy in all manners of conversation. Because it is written, Be ye holy, for I am holy. Yes, sir. People are being constantly pressured to conform, to follow the crowd. Even people of God are encouraged, or shall I say pressured, to follow the crowd. All right. But we need to understand that God's people are different. The gospel called a separation uh, between Christians and the world. Yes, sir. Christians are called to be a holy people. Mm -hmm. Holiness is necessary if eternal life uh, is realized. And so for the next few minutes, we want to look at uh, be ye holy. Be ye holy. Now, why is it so important that we be holy? What is it that uh, 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 makes us different and should make us different from the world? Well, first of all, we need to understand that we should strive uh, to be perfect because, number one, God uh, is holy. And we should strive to be holy because He is holy. Well, Notice what the Bible says in 1 Samuel chapter 2, and the verse is 2. It says, there is none holy as the Lord, but there is none beside thee. Neither is there any rock like unto our God. So we are encouraged to be holy, number one, because God is holy. Yes, sir. But not only that, we are encouraged to be holy because God commands us to be holy. Amen. Once again, I will read it from 1 Peter chapter 1. Verses 15 and 16. Once again, it says, <clears throat> it says, because it is written, be ye holy, for I am holy. Amen. You need to understand as people of God, as children of God, there is no option in being holy. Wow. We are commanded by God to be holy because He is holy. Mm -hmm. But not only that, not only that, we are to be holy because holiness identifies who we are. Right. We need to understand that we are not like the world and we should not act like the world. We should not conform ourselves to the world because God has commanded us to be different from the world. And when we are holy, we are, we, we are a people who are being identified as someone different from the world. Right. In Ephesians chapter 1 and the verses 4, the Bible says, According as he has chosen us in him mm -hmm. before the foundation of the world, that we should be holy and without blame before him in love. So we are to be holy because we are to be different and people should look at us and should be able to see something different about us. Amen. But not only that, my friend, we, we should be holy because we must influence the world. I believe it was Jesus who told us to be the light of the world. Well, and if the world is going to see Jesus, the world must see Jesus in us and through us. You must be holy because God is holy. You must be holy because God commands you to be holy. You must be holy because God, you are God's chosen people. And we 
we are encouraged to influence the world. We know that this world is in, is in a bad shape. It's in a bad situation. And people are looking for something different. People are looking to be influenced in the right way. Man, but we know man. that this world has many influences, but the only right and the only perfect influence is the Christian influence. Mm -hmm. And so we should encourage people, we should encourage people to be like God because we are encouraged to be like God. Man. When, 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 when you love the things that God loves and hate the things that God hates and measure everything by the standard of God's divine world, the word, I want you to know that you can achieve holiness, but also you can encourage others to be holy. All right. Holiness. Holiness is a necessity in this life for the child of God. There is no, there, there is no, I think about it, or I get back with you. We are commanded to be holy. Let us remember the song in our song book. Take time to be holy. All right. We take time for everything else, but we need to take time to be holy. Man. We need to remember that we are a, a, a chosen people, mm -hmm. that we are a royal priesthood, yes, that we are to be holy because our God is holy. Man. So let us encourage each other, not only on this day, but every day. Let us encourage one another to be holy. For in being so, I believe that we can win the world for Jesus Christ. Man. May God bless us and may God help us. Man, man. <laughs> Church, amen. <laughs>